good day everyone welcome to my channel RedTube, and thank you for watching this video now on this video I'm going to walk you through step-by-step -step instruction on how to recover a corrupted PowerPoint file so to give an example uh, say that you have been working on a PowerPoint presentation where you have put so many hours on that particular deck and all of a sudden your computer crashes when you restart your computer, when you try to open a PowerPoint file, it doesn't open. It gives an error message saying that the, you cannot open this PowerPoint file and it has been corrupted. And um, you have been on that particular presentation. Let's say you have inserted a lot of media, uh, probably uh, pictures or it could be a sound file. And now you don't have those sound files. Um, what is that you, you're going to do to restore them? What is that you're going to do to restore those media files? So I'm going to walk you through step-by-step -step instruction on what are the steps you need to follow to recover the PowerPoint presentation. And probably uh, I would also give you an instruction on um, the last resort on how to uh, restore uh, at least the media files what you have uh, inserted in that presentation it could be a narration uh, which you have uh, recorded for your powerpoint or it could be an edited uh, media file which you have inserted in a powerpoint presentation so the first thing uh, so this would be let's take an example for the demonstration purpose let's consider this is a corrupt file all right uh, this is a corrupt file which you're not able to open so the first thing you will have to do is you will have to open a powerpoint with no data in it click on file click on open go to the desktop and select that particular video file now if this video open without any, any error message well and good you don't have to do anything you can start make sure you try to save this file with a different file name on a different location and you can continue working on this file let's say this doesn't work um, it still gives an error message saying that this file cannot be open so the next thing what you can do is um, open the PowerPoint uh, on your computer again now once you're on the home page click on new slide now from the drop-down menu click on reuse slide okay now this is where you will go ahead and insert the uh, presentation Okay, or probably a slide what we are doing is we are reusing those particular slide on that presentation now these this method can also be used to recover the slide uh, or recover the data from the corrupted presentation if the uh, if the data is not that corrupted okay so browse to the location where you have saved that particular file Click on the desktop from the drop down menu and wow. Uh, desktop and select that particular file. Now, if there is not too much corruption or if the data is not that corrupt in that particular file you can view the slides which is there on the slide which you have been working earlier so what you can do is in order you can get these slides imported on the new powerpoint file but when you do this please make sure that you select keep source formatting so that it doesn't lose the formatting which you have already uh, done on that particular file you don't have to put uh, another few hours to do formatting on that presentation so you select that slide so that will insert the slide from the corrupted powerpoint file so once you have all the slide in this uh, presentation um, or in this particular file you can go ahead and rename this file with a different file name all right this is another way if this works you're good to go no need of uh, trying the next step now if this doesn't work the next step would be open a run command on your computer okay and in the run command delete what you have uh, in the run command window drag and drop your PowerPoint file and click on OK so this is another way to recover the file okay now if this doesn't work 
if it works all you can do is you can save this powerpoint file and start working on it now if this doesn't work another way to do is open powerpoint in application safe mode uh, now what this does is it disables all the third party add-ons which are configure or uh, which are integrated with powerpoint so what in order to open the powerpoint in application safe mode what you do is you go ahead and type power pnt space give a space forward slash safe so it will open up the powerpoint okay let me close this from the previous slide so uh, powerpoint will open up in the application safe mode go to file go to open and go to the location where you have the corrupted file this should ideally open the uh, corrupted data file now all these steps if it works well and good if it doesn't work you still have a last hope or a last resort uh, at least to restore the media files what you have inserted in the uh, in the powerpoint slide so what you do is create a copy of this powerpoint file okay rename this particular file i'm going to sh uh, tell you how to go ahead and rename it so you do a right click on that particular powerpoint file click on rename and change the file extension from pptx to zip okay so if you have a powerpoint slide which is of uh, slideshow format dot pps all you have to do is rename the file extension to dot zip and hit enter if you get a prompt which says if you change the file name extension if the file might become unusable are you sure you want to change it yes i want to change it and why i'm doing it is because i know that i've created a copy of it so i'm not losing anything from here so i'm going to click on yes so what this will do is this will change the file name into zip format and it will open up in the file explorer window now in order to extract the media file what you need to do is you need to open that particular zip file go to ppt under ppt you will find media files under this folder you would see all the images or it could be all the videos or it, it could be all the uh, audio files which you have inserted in this deck will be visible here okay so this is another way to restore your powerpoint media file i hope this video will help you to restore your corrupted powerpoint file um, these are the steps uh, in case if these the steps doesn't work there are a third party uh, softwares which are available over the internet you can search in the google for those software but when you install this software make sure those are the recommended ones. If a, if you see a website saying that you can go ahead and restore the file, if, if you're purchasing it, just don't go ahead and buy it and install it on your computer. It could be uh, malware. It, it, that particular software could be malware infected. You might see an adverse effect on this. So before you install any third party uh, software recovery tools, make sure you check the reviews, see what people are saying about it, who have already used it, and then go ahead and purchase it and install it. Uh, thank you for watching this video and uh, there are more videos to come in. Please make sure you click on the subscribe button on the bottom left corner of the screen so that you get notification on every video what I add on this channel. And if you like this video, click on the like button and also share this video. Let, um, let, let everyone know that the, there are steps to recover um, the corrupted files, corrupted PowerPoint files, rather than uh, investing or you know uh, putting uh, hundreds of dollars to restore that. Uh, they can do it by themselves. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.